Directors voted to approve an amendment to the budget for a bottom ash rewatering project at Leland Old Station. When the project was first approved by the board, staff was under a very short timeline. As work continued on engineering, they realized they would need $17 million more to complete the project. Project Manager 2 Josh Rossow explains the need for the project and why the board tabled their decision until this month. This project is as a result of the uh, coal combustion residue rule and the effluent limitations guideline rule put forth by the EPA, which uh, we cannot put uh, bottom ash or water that has come into contact with bottom ash into a, our settling pond. And so we have to come up with a net, uh, another way to deal with that bottom ash and the associated water. The project was initially approved in January of 2016 for $45.6 million and at that time the project was on a very tight schedule and so the uh, budget estimate had was based on limited information and after that approval was given the uh, courts uh, made a ruling that essentially gave us another year to to finish the project and so we went back and took a closer look at that budget estimate and we saw that a budget amendment was necessary. We went to the board last month for a budget amendment and the after discussion the board decided to table the decision for a month. I think that the board was having a difficult time um, reconciling the, the request for, for funds for this project with um, potential looming other environmental regulations like clean power plan and um, regional haze and things like that. And so they wanted to get the big picture story of what's out there for Leland Olds. The, the team from environmental finance Cooperative Planning and Operations did a great job with the presentation today, laying out the, the case for the project and ultimately why it's in the best interest for the cooperative.